I caught my wife sleeping with my own son from my other wife. Then what I did to both of them will definitely shock you. Hello, everyone today, I'm going to share with you guys an eye-opening and life-turning story of my life that will surely give you goosebumps. But before getting into the video, don't forget to subscribe to our channel for more rev. And in crossing real couple stories, meet me. This is Ramon Joe. I'm based in Washington where I currently am working in a marketing company. Sadly, the way my own son and my wife deceived me is unforgettable and unforgivable. I had not ever thought that they both were doing all this just because please watch the full video until the end. If you really want to know how my own son and my wife actually dished me and then how I gave them a lifetime lesson. Ah, uh, let's start from the very beginning. I got married in 2001 with my classmate. Our marriage life is going well. We very soon blessed with a baby boy named James as well. But unfortunately, tracing to the year 2017, I lost my wife who was suffering from brain cancer. This was indeed a big loss of my life. After my wife's death, I started spending more time on my work side. Like I really wanted to give my son a luxurious life. To be honest, during this whole time till my son turned a teenage, many women gave me an offer to get married with them. But I never considered because I didn't want to give my son a stepmother at all. I used to take care of him like a baby. Even when he turned into a teenager one day when it was my son's birthday, he invited his teacher as well to whom he was really very close. Like I was literally shocked to see that my son was in a close bond with her. My son then introduced me to his teacher and said that she was like a mother to him. To be honest, that woman was really very pretty but was quite mature, maybe five or six years younger than me. The way my son's teacher greeted me made me realize that the teacher knew a lot about me. Well, without considering her more, I went to the other guest the same night when the party got over, my son came to me and asked about her teacher. I laughed and asked in a joking way from my son if he was interested in his teacher because he was continuously talking about his teacher. I exactly remember his awkwardness and strange response. He literally stood up from his place and showed me his anger bulging eyes. I had not ever seen him in a cringy state like this before. He left my room by harshly closing the door of my room. I kept thinking about my son's strange behavior that night. Well, after about four days when I was working in my office, I received a phone call from my son's college where I was shocked to hear that my son was in the hospital because he got injured while playing. He was admitted to the hospital. I panicked and hurriedly went to the hospital in order to see my son on reaching the hospital. I wondered if I could see my son's teacher already at the hospital. She was taking care of my son like a mother. I completely fell in love with her. At that moment. The same night, my son insisted I got married with his teacher because according to him, she took care of him like her own son. I also used to like her so soon I got married to my son's teacher named Jasmine. Initial days of our married life were really good. Like I was so happy after getting the wonderful bedtime. After a long time, Jasmine was so caring and responsible that I was really so crazy for her. One day, I noticed something really strange like I fully agreed that my son's bond with my wife was really strong and good before my marriage. But my son's involvement in our bedtime was a disgusting thing at all. Like I remember whenever I used to be very high and Jasmine was on the bed, my son used to interrupt us by coming to our room without even knocking. I always used to ignore everything. But with time I realized a lot it was a Saturday night. I was sleeping peacefully. Meanwhile, I got my eyes open in order to cringe my thirst. I found my wife nowhere in the bedroom. Well, I obviously did not consider it and slept again with the thought that maybe my wife was in the washroom. 
But again, when I woke up at 3 a.m. of the night, my wife was still not in the bedroom. I got worried about her and decided to check her out in the house. I was just about to leave the room when I saw my wife coming from my son's room. What who was doing at the dark hour of the night in my son's room? My brain was asking a million questions. I remember as soon as my wife found me awake, she began to fix her shirt's button. She was sweating badly. That time I had ever seen her so confused before. Without me asking, she began to give me an explanation that my son was not feeling well. So she was giving him the medicine. I remember she was continuously looking down because she had no words to say at all. Ah, I didn't consider the late night matter that time and instead got worried about my son's help when I went to his room. She was hitting the, at that time I was shocked to see him fully naked. What was the actual matter the sight I had just seen was continuously popping up in my mind. I didn't sleep that night properly, but obviously I didn't consider anything. I noticed one thing that my son started taking off from his college without any real whenever I used to ask him that why he was not going to his college. His excuses was always the same that he had already completed his whole course. One day I saw something that was really unbelievable for me to accept. I remember it was a Sunday's night for my friend invited me at his house for a barbecue. I didn't find any hair conditioner anywhere in the washroom. I even asked my wife about the conditioner. She was fully immersed in the mobile phone that she didn't respond to me. And I went to my son's washroom because he usually used to take my stuff from my washroom for you. He was outside at that time, maybe along with his friends, what I had seen in my son's washroom will shock you. To be honest, I didn't go to my son's room without his permission. But that time I was getting very late so I went in when I opened my son's washroom, I found my wife Lang hanging in his washroom. Well, once my feet froze, I really didn't know how to react. I panicked and called my wife to my son's washroom. When she reached the washroom, she began to sweat. She realized that I caught their fare. I exactly remember her response. She began to laugh loudly and said that my son was insisting her to give her lingerie to him. Because according to my wife, my son wanted to wear that lingerie because he was pranking with his friend. While the way my wife lied with me literally worked. And I also started laughing. I was actually the dumb person. He used to trust both of them a lot. In spite of having a lot of red flags, things were getting complicated. Day by day, it was a Sunday's night when my wife was in the kitchen and was making garlic bread for me. I was watching the movie when the atom of garlic bread came across me. I got excited and decided to hug my wife from back. Surprisingly. Well, I off the TV and went to the kitchen on reaching the kitchen. I was shocked to see my wife and my son kissing passionately. They both were fully immersed in each other. I obviously got fierce and yelled at them. They got very confused. My son began to cry loudly and said that Jasmine was like a mother to him. I was angry on there at this act. The way my wife and my son managed, the situation will shock you. I remember how cunningly they both begin to show me that they were a mother and a son to each other. I must say that kiss was not a motherhood kiss to her son but that it was a proper passionate romantic kiss at all on reaching my workplace. What happened last night was continuously on my nose. I realized that everything happening was a matter to consider, but I didn't know how to uncover the fact behind all the clues. Well, at first, I decided to ask my son about his actual intentions for my wife. But then I thought that obviously he did not admit what he did on reaching the house. My wife was sitting with my son and was as usual. They were gossiping lovingly. I then thought that maybe I was wrong about them. So I started ignoring their relationship by thinking that my wife was just like a close and sincere mother for my son. I started feeling weak and dizzy. Day by day, I went to the doctor as well who took my blood tests one day when I was working peacefully in my workplace. 
One of my neighbors appeared in front of me. He used to live in front of our house. In spite of living in the same neighborhood, we had never talked to each other before. I was just wondering about his sudden appearance in my workplace. He asked me to give job with his son to my workplace. Well, I smiled and asked him to sit. We started the conversation but then he said something that will blow up your mind. We both were having the conversation about our sons. When that neighbor congratulated me for my son's marriage, I laughed and told him that my son was unmarried. I remember his strange face expression. He told me that he had often saw my son from window romancing with a lady having a black hair color. After hearing his words, I became shocked. I was literally like a fish out of water. At that time, I had not ever thought that my son and my wife would actually be ditching me. I decided to fix the camera in our house in order to know the whole situation. I secretly fixed the camera and linked my mobile phone as well so that I may know all the activities happening that time. At the same time, I got on work and an important and urgent work from my workplace. So that day, I wasn't able to check out the camera recording. Even that night, I reached at about three meters of the house. The next morning when I woke up, my soul trembled after realizing that my wife was in a relationship with my son because everything was recorded fully about how my wife was seducing my my son and how they both did a lot of physical activities in my absence, tears trickled down my cheeks. I hadn't ever thought that how my son was actually playing with me. Even after seeing the whole recording, I wasn't able to believe that. Well, I was burning with revenge. That time I invited my wife's colleagues and my son's friend to our house. All of them belonged to the same car. As soon as my son and my wife came to know about that random and sudden party, they were extremely confused and were continuously asking me the reason for that party. Well, I played my wife's bed video with my son at front of everyone. Everyone was just shocked and abusing my son and my wife. I said at front of everyone, that lady actually spoiled my son. I remember how was praising in order to defend him about my son then confessed something that will shock you. He said that he came to know from his late mother that he wasn't my biological father. He was living with me just for the property. He further said that I was the only reason of his mother's death. He got brain because of me because that time I used to date her best friend, which was impossible for her to accept. After realizing the reality, my feet froze and I highly shocked. He further confessed that it was her plan with her teacher to trap me like this. She was her account who had an idea of property distribution. He made me crystal clear that they both were waiting for my death. At the same night, I received a call from the doctor who told me that someone was giving me the slow poisons medicine. Now I am admitted to the hospital. The police had arrested my son and my wife. I had never thought that the boy once who was everything was actually a snake in the grass. To be honest, I have no motivation to live. Now, please.